So during the hurricane, there was a couple times it got really, really bad to where our trees were going like from this to this and the kids were really scared. You know, we were concerned and worried about what was gonna happen after, you know, the aftermath of all of it. When we took the shutters off and we opened the door for the first time, what's it all gonna look like? Directly after the storm, we knew we couldn't stay at our house at that point. So um, my husband recommended that we go to the uh, Estero Recreation Center, which he hadn't experienced before with Hurricane Irma, that the Red Cross was there. And so he told me about that and I was like, okay, let's go. I had never been to a shelter before. So I was a little nervous because what you see on TV, but it was nothing like that. It was so much different because of the American Red Cross. Well, it's really amazing. There's no other way for me to use except for the love that uh, the American Red Cross has really showed us um, and showed our whole family since the moment we got here. So the American Red Cross came in and we were actually laying down and they just assumed take over the kids area and started playing with all the kids. Um, they went and played basketball with my son and a few of the other kids. She sat down, one of the other ladies from Red Cross sat down and did a puzzle with Gabriel, a 300 piece puzzle. So she has a lot of patience. It was just really nice to see, like my husband said, the love that they showed us and other families and our kids especially. It's certain that the donors that donate to the American Red Cross, every dollar gets put towards good use. Um, there's babies here that have diapers and their formula all the way to adults that have hygiene products, um, clothes, every basic need has been met for me and my family and for everyone in the shelter. And that's only because of the people that donate.